Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I had to replace a door handle on my kids' room and I found out that the door handle I was trying to put in is not the same one that I was taking out and it didn't actually have the big hole in the middle so that I could center the door handle on it. Uh, so I figured be a, this would be a good opportunity to use the door handle template made by Ryobi and it's really cool so it actually has the hole saw here, has the template on the outside and it has the um, hinge placement or the strike placement on the inside. So without further ado, let's get closer to the door. Let's check this out. We'll drill the hole, see how it goes. So let's just take a quick look at uh, the template itself so you can see it does the more shallower side um, or it does the deeper side so um, and then here this is the other cross bore here and how it actually works it can go to thicker doors and to thinner doors and all you have to do is center it you put your mounting screws that holds it in place there and then you just drill your hole here while it's still in place you drill your hole here and this is to help you uh, get your striking plate mounted against the jam itself. But let's uh, mount this to the door and then we'll drill the hole. So first this is um, the actual hole saw itself, the drill bit. Make sure it goes in properly and you also have your depth setting for the drill bit inside. Make sure it's tight itself. Um, this is going to work out uh, just fine for us, but um, you need to make sure that that is taller than the teeth of the uh, hole saw itself. So we will use the uh, trusty P251 here. Oh, my dog's barking. I'm sorry. There's the hole from that side, and there's the hole from that side. Okay, so let's take this off. Okay, that's it. It fits good. I can now latch it. I need to put the last screw in here. Um, I'll tighten this up and you're done. That's it. All right guys, that's it. So without this template, I do have to say it would have taken me probably three times the amount of time in order to get this done and the reason why is that with a paper template you have to line it up around the door and then you have to manually make sure that you get it straight through the door with a hole so it's not going at an angle and you can see with this it's pretty thick and this actually lines up the hole saw so it does go straight through the door uh, so it is level and flat uh, so I think it's super a uh, good tool. I think it's worth the money and the amount of time that you're going to save with this is totally worth it and it does just about everything that you would want it to do. So I hope that you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and uh, we'll see you in the next video. Thanks everybody.